when we are born, we take in part of the trauma which is moving through our mothers, the generational trauma which is there. And uh, this trauma is reflected in our parents. You know, the first attraction to the parents is their qualities, their beauty, their love. But then the daily life reality is so different of as what you feel as a child, which is the promise inside. And that's a reflection of the traumas. But this trauma is also inside us, in our cells, in our body. And it starts to f vibrate with it. And so there is this rejection going on. Not this. I'm totally alone. I cannot live with this. I have to take care of myself. There is no real care of me, and that's a rupture, that's a very basic rupture. So then we get married, and we marry exactly our mother, or our father. How is that possible if it's not there? And, <laughs> and then, you know, after a while, after the, the kind of, you know, being in love is over, <laughs> we see ourselves exactly behaving like our father or like our mother. How is this possible if it was not there, if it uh, doesn't exist? With the same pains, with the same woundedness, with the same contraction, with the same fear, don't leave me, don't leave me. The same patterns. So it is important at a certain point to open up for this layer as well. The layer which kind of, you know, we take with us by being born. It's part of the work, the surface we are born in, which is part of our lives.